With the new basketball season on the horizon, expectations for the Homestead boys and girls teams are at an all-time high. But there's another group of students who are anticipating this season getting underway, possibly just as much as the players. These are the fans that make up the Homestead High School student section. And for them, this season is particularly exciting. This year has the potential to be the best in the school's history for both the girls' and boys' teams, creating an even bigger student following than previous years. On the high school level, first day of boys' basketball practice here in the state of Indiana and at Homestead, oh yeah, expectations are high for the Spartans. Mr. Basketball frontrunner Caleb Swanigan is back. They also added transfers Jordan Geist of Penn and J.J. Foster of Lures. The student section has long been a part of Spartan history, but the 2014-15 school year is the first year with a club dedicated exclusively to improving the student section. The club holds weekly meetings consisting of students from all grades. The club and the student section are both led by senior student Nick Anderson. Nick's enthusiasm towards the organization and the school's facilities makes him the ideal candidate for leading the cheers. What makes it really unique is the fact that we have such a small gym and with all those kids making all that noise in that little confined area, we can get really, really loud and the other team is really intimidated by us. The club spends its time debating themes and creating cheers to rally the fans at games. The club also organizes events, a school-wide ALS Ice Bucket Challenge and Homestead Hysteria, which is a rally for the upcoming basketball season, have already taken place. Nick Anderson and company have a multitude of events planned for the future. The student section consists of hundreds of Spartans, all cooperating to make as much noise as possible. Even second year, Homestead High School principal Park Ginder, who has held administrative positions at other Indiana high schools such as Carroll, Northrop, and DeKalb, feels the Homestead student section is notably impressive in comparison to others. When you make runs at a semi-state or a state final and then have good teams afterward, uh, you tend to have big followings. Uh, but this year's group is the biggest I've ever seen. Uh, so that's, that's exciting. It's a lot of fun. With the boys starting the season ranked number two in the state and having one of the top nationally ranked ESPN players, Caleb Biggie Swanigan, the school's hopes for this season are high. Not only are the boys a formidable opponent, the girls team is ranked number four and have ambitious expectations for their season. Having such a large following can be fun for those involved, but the support from the student body is also beneficial to the players. It definitely adds to the atmosphere of the game and makes it more fun and enjoyable to be at. The student section is responsible for raising the energy of the crowd, but their main responsibility is to encourage the players. We don't get like energy from ourselves. Like It's hard to get energy by ourselves, but from the student section, we uh, them getting loud and them chanting, that really gets us like excited and energy, and we're, that's really what we're looking forward to playing this year, too. The student section can make the difference with a home court advantage. You can see the Homestead student section in action for the first game of the season at Homestead, where the boys will take on Huntington North at 745. Special thanks to WANE News Channel 15 for allowing us to use a clip from Glen Marini's sportscast. For Homestead Highlight, I'm Mattis McConaughey, reporting for WCYT, The Point 91 FM.